Yo Huey, I was watching Wild and Out, and you missed the most hilarious part brah. Not now Riley. Homie seriously you have to listen to this, Snoop Dogg and his cousin Sasha Banks from the WWF was roasting the shit out of everybody main. I said not now Riley. Snoop Dogg was like, if you wanna come to party with the D-O-double-G you gotta bring a couple of ladies, because we gon' be partying at the club all night, and Sasha was like as long as you don't snitch, because you know what they say, snitches get stitches, and if you ever think about crossing the boss, you gon' get your head tossed. Riley how many times do I have to tell you? Negro I swear to god I was rollin'. I'm not alone Riley. Oh excuse me, maybe I'll come back in another 5 hours, since that's how long you take your showers. Sorry Riley, if you're waiting for the shower, you might have to wait till tomorrow, cause Huey and I are going crazy in here. You know what, you two continue taking y'all showers Viola and Jahari. Me Jack here, is gonna go back downstairs and continue watching TV. Hey this toilet don't work right? Nah I don't think so Riley, I think Grandad just gone have to call the plumbers to have him fix it. <laughs> let me see. Ah. Uh... Fixed it. Riley I'm gonna kill you. Well you gone have to come catch me playboy. Granddad. Hey, kid. How you doing? Good. That's cool. Hey, I'm gonna need you and Huey's help getting a few things out of the car. Oh, Fasha Big Pops. Here, Riley. You know I have a bad back. I can't carry too much things. Damn! What's all this? Take it in the house and I'll tell you. Now what I have in here is a box of a costume. Why you just didn't say costume in a box? Just listen. Goof off later. Now I have a costume in here. What kind of costume? A really big costume. And since Huey is not downstairs, I guess I'm gonna have to have you do it. Do what? You and I are going to go to a football game tomorrow. Oh cool. Who we gonna watch play? I'm gonna be coaching. You're gonna be watching the game while wearing the costume. Wait, what's the costume? Granddad, are you kidding me? I'm not going to the football field looking like this. Do the job or you're fired. I'm going to get the snacks. <laughs> hey look, it's Riley the Giant Gecko. Or maybe you're supposed to be the green version of Ned Brachiosaurus from the cartoon show Dinosaur Train. Oh shut up Huey. I'm never gonna forgive you for this. Oh cheer up Riley, look at the bright side. What's the bright side? When someone talks bad about your rap albums you bite the rar out of them. Oh haha very funny. Man I look stupid in this costume. Other people's hands arms legs feet and asses has been all in this thing. Riley just get it over with. Granddad might pay you. Pay me what? More clones? Okay Riley. Let's go rock the game. Yeah you gun rock the game I'm gun rock the shame. Huey? When I get back. I'm a bite the rar out of you. Oh, I'm so scared. You should be. When I get back, I'm a bite the rar out of you. Boy, please, you won't even survive two seconds against the Incredible Hulk. Hi, Ada. Hi. How you doing? Fine. What you doing looks like you're really busy. Yeah I am, Huey I'm a be taking a long trip to Pennsylvania pretty soon. Really? What part? 
Philadelphia. And yes I am. How long will you be gone? A week and a half. My brother died. My family is planning a funeral in Philadelphia and every single one of us is going. Man I hate to hear that. How did he die? Not that it's really any of my business. Oh he died from heart shrinkage. He got too old. What he only had to been 75 years old? 77? 8? T? 1? I am the baby out of all seven of my siblings. Oldest 85, second 82, third 80, fourth 79, fifth 74, sixth 70. And I'm only 68. Man, I hope Grandad lives his life long. Yeah, he will. Well, I am I may go upstairs and start packing. Okay. Hey, Agla. Yes. Um, whenever you feel any better, wanna go out and um, go to the cafe? Or anywhere else? You're really sweet, Huey. But not right now, maybe later. Wait, 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 wait. Grandad doesn't know about this whole... You know something? I tried telling him, but he didn't even give a damn. Your grandfather is a pig. Damn! What's up, little kid? How was the game? Shut up! I'm still mad at you. What you still talking about biting the rar out of me? Come on, go ahead and do it so you can get it out your mind. I love to you backstabbing son of a bitch. Um Riley? I said how was the game? The game was good. All I did was dance. You danced in that dinosaur costume? Yay, it wasn't that hard. You wanna see the dance moves I did? Look. Bow. Bow. Let's go. God congratulations Riley, you managed to turn me into Elmo the Puppet from Sesame Street. <laughs> Yeah, Elmo with a afro. Afro Elmo. Look anyway, there's something we gotta talk about. What's that? I just gonna be taking a trip out of town pretty soon. Yes! What do you mean yes? Do you even know why? No? Why? Her oldest brother's dead and her family's planning a funeral. We're going. No, we're not going. She tried telling Granddad and he didn't even care. What? Grandad is a genius. I mean that old ass negro. Man how can Grandad be so cold? I mean Ita's brother's dead. Wait how old is her brother? 85. Man all old people die that old. Like look at Grandad. He's already in his 80s. Grandad is 71 years old dumbass. Now quit acting like you don't give a damn. We gotta support Ida through this. Are you right? I shouldn't be acting a fool. Our future grandmother lost a bro, and we gotta go support her. So what we gon' do? You gon' take off that T-Rex costume. We gon' take showers cause you shot your red paint all over me and other people bodies been in that costume. You don't need to be catching what they have. Now let's do this. I G, I'm with you. Okay. What's on the pause? Um. Mud? I'm a beat to ass. Hi Riley. Ooh who did I just open the door for? Um? For me? Tatiana. Girl you look really hot in that dress. I don't know if you came here to come take Huey out or you came to give Huey a booty call. Look thank you. Nice compliment. Look is Huey here? I wanna take him to a party. There might be room for you. Oh hell yeah. But um, Huey's um, upstairs. Hey Huey. Tatiana's at the door for you. Bri you is lucky. Yo girl is dressed as the same color as a banana. She looks gorgeous. Riley do me a favor and move out the way before you drool on her. Cause you already doing the floor. I'm sorry brah, go to your thing. 
What's up banana pudding? What's shaking in this sexy yellow dress? Nothing but ass juicy fruit, nothing but ass. Where is my sugar? I got yo sugar. And another? And another? One last one. Look can we take that in a hotel room or something? Look is there a reason you came here? What? Yes I know to see me and all, but you wanted to go out or do something? Yeah I wanted to come pick you up for the party. Look em. Look I can't come, I got something important to do. But I'm in my yellow dress and my black undertights, and my yellow high heels, just for you. I thought there was room for me. Look how about we go upstairs and get crazy. You just read my mind, let's go. I knew she wanted to come over for a booty call. Wow, it's pretty dark in here, what's going on? Afro Huey is finna give it to you rough, that's what's going on. I call him Mini Me, I'm finna do you like a bear baby. Don't look at me, don't look at me lil puppet, can I get a woo woo? Woo. Woo? No you gotta say woo. 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 Just how I like it girl. Afro Huey is an hungry bear. Uh, hey. Hey Riley! How could you old man, huh? You really had to do it, huh? What the hell are you talking about? Don't give me that fake BS, how could you do such a thing? Riley Freeman you better get the hell off my case. Oh I'll get off your case playboy, soon as you give me some answers. How could you embarrass someone in a diabolical way? What? I was gonna share my dignity with you, but it turns out, you are so foul old man. I think you better sit down mister. Why should I sit down? What you gon' tie me up and disrespect me like you did Ida? Ida? Yeah Ida. When in the hell did I ever disrespect Ida? When? I'll tell you when. Ida told you she lost her oldest brother and you didn't give a damn about it. Granddad you're supposed to support her through this situation and tell her you're sorry to hear that. But instead, you wanted to push it out the way like inconsiderate jackass. Granddad you are the most fullest guy I was ever born after, I hope you- Riley why are you talking to your grandfather like that? Ida, I'm straightening up granddad for you. Ida doesn't deserve to be treated like this, she deserves to be supported and- Token care of? No no no. She deserves to have faith, and you haven't gave her neither. Get out, old man. First of all, you better watch your mouth, damn it. You don't talk to me however you want. I'm your freaking grandfather, I will whoop that candy ass of yours. Talking to me any kind of way, Negro, you set trippin'. You better go take that crap back to Chicago. You don't throw that behavior in this house, young man. I don't wanna do something to this punk. Yeah. Don't you ever talk to your grandfather like that again, you ignorant piece of... Ooh. Boy if I was yo mother I would tear yo ass up boy you is so lucky I'm not. Your job for him is you don't run your mouth at him like that, he would send yo ass back to the Windy City. Talking to him any kind of way you don't know who you think you talking to boy. But Ida it was just a play. Just a play just a play just a play my rear end. What's with all the yelling? I'm going to the kitchen and making me something healthy. I'm gonna get ready to pack up. Ida can I drive you to the airport? Your granddaddy will, but thank you baby. No problem. So what was with all the yelling? I freaked out at granddad. 
You freak out at granddad. Yay. Like inconsiderate jackass. Huey, I think I owe granddad an apology. You think? Not tough boy you owe him an apology 100%. You might wanna go in there and do so. Yay I will. Granddad. What do you want? Granddad, I didn't mean to flip out at you like that cause if you didn't come in here and made that shake, you'd be whipping my candy ass right now. Look I just thought you were avoiding what I was telling you about her bro's death. Riley, I know her brother is dead. She told me two days ago. She did? Yeah, if I didn't hear about it you and Huey wouldn't know. Yes when she told me I was watching basketball, but I understood, yep she said she will be going to Pennsylvania for a week and a half. Man, granddad I hope you live as long as I does brother, or longer. Ah don't blow it, I probably won't, I'll probably be dead in another five years for all I know. Granddad. Don't you dare talk like that, you gone live damn it. Didn't I tell you to watch your mouth? My bad, I'll be back in the living room. Okay. Oh Ida, you must be ready. Yes I am. I'm sorry about your brother Ida, it's sad me Huey and Grandad has never met him. No it's fine, it's just a tada. A. A tada? Yea you'll see him in heaven. But we never met him. Damn it Riley we'll see him in heaven okay? Okay. Okay Ida, I'm sorry to hear about your brother too. He was a good person wasn't he? Yes he was, but unfortunately he's gone. Hey honey, you ready to go? Yes let's go, before I miss my plane. Okay. Boys, if you're coming, let's go. Okay, we'll be outside. You apologize to Granddad. Yep. Good. Come on, let's get going. Hey, Huey. Yeah. Nice way to receive a booty call from Tatiana. Maybe I'll teach you ways how to receive them in the car. Ah, good looking out, G. No problem, little kid. Come on, let's go. Huey? Where are you? Huey? Where is my dress? From the day of the week, to the month of the year, I'll destroy Huey, make him shoot all their tears. With a can of beer, from a reindeer, I'll steal yo girl I have no fear I'll destroy yo career. Now that didn't go right. Yeah that sucked. Huey is that you? Yay. Yeah. What are you doing? Just using the bathroom. All done. Okay, just don't flush the toilet. <coughs> Huey, I told you not to flush you, Stooge. Rock to the rhythm, you don't stop.